Gases can also be collected using upwards or downwards delivery, depending on their density uh, com as compared to the density of air. So as an example here, I'm going to react hydrochloric acid with magnesium and the gas produced is hydrogen. Now hydrogen chemical formula is H2 whereas air is composed mainly of nitrogen which is N2. So nitrogen density is much higher than hydrogen density. So we ex expect that hydrogen gas is going to float in air. So if it's going to float in air, the best way to collect hydrogen gas is by upward delivery. This way the hydrogen will go up and collect it in this test tube. But this method is not for gas volume measurement. It's only to collect your gas and later on um, test the gas using chemical reaction. So let's get on with the experiment. I have here hydrochloric acid. And I'll drop in a piece of mag magnesium ribbon and bring this upwards like that. I'm hoping the hydrogen is going to collect in the test tube. Mm. Mm. I'm going to repeat the same reaction, but this time let's collect the gas using downward delivery and we will see how different the gas collected is. So here I'm hoping that the hydrogen gas is going to be delivered into this test tube. Okay, reaction has ended. So I'm gonna put a stopper in this tube. Turn off. Compare which tube contains more hydrogen gas. We can see that the upward delivery method um, collected more hydrogen gas because we heard such loud noise, uh, a pop sound, but downward delivery method um, did not give us that pop sound. So for hydrogen collection, upward delivery is much more effective.